sports. In most cases, there are gender lines drawn throughout high school sports. We have boys and girls teams for basketball, soccer, tennis, and more. We have both baseball and softball squads. But what if a young lady wants to play football? Well, in that case, she's bound to be competing against the guys. And tonight, our John Rawlings introduces us to the girls on the gridiron at a couple of our area's largest and lately most successful programs. Football has been called a barbaric sport. However, not all barbarians have the same view. It could be a really delicate sport too, like if you see Jaden running the ball, how he just runs, it's like he's on his toes, kind of like a ballerina, so I wouldn't say it's barbaric. Two girls, Gabby Dulaban of Wapakoneta and Brianna Wright from Lima Senior, have rid of the stereotype that football is only for boys. Usually when you see like football, you always see dudes, but then I saw the one movie by Kiki Palmer, and I was like, man, I can do that. I can do that, that's easy. I really just, I enjoyed playing the game so much and I wanted to see what it was like actually being on the field and then you felt you fall in love with the game. Both girls play on defense, meaning they have to make hits and the teams don't let up just because of their gender. Uh, they don't take it any easier on me than I take it on them. I, I, when you get a hit, your adrenaline starts getting a little high and it's just everything you work for is right there in front of you. Expectation of her is no different than anybody else on the team. You know, we expect her to compete at a high level and, and to work hard, and, and she's done that. And to me, I think that's the reason why she's been accepted by her teammates. Sometimes they want to be a little soft on me, but go ahead and hit me, I don't, I don't care. She played in a, in a JV game last week and actually um, jammed some, some receivers up pretty good, so she's getting a lot better. I'm proud of her, just like I'm proud of all the guys on the team, just coming out every day and sticking with it and um, giving that never, never give up, never give in um, mentality. Gabby plays for her love of the game. The relationships you get out of the game, you get a lot of friends and you get a brotherhood or siblings. Uh, it's just your family gets so much bigger when you're out on the field. We're fortunate that we have a person that simply loves the game of football. And, you know, if somebody loves the game of football, we want to give them that opportunity to play. And Brianna plays to inspire. I feel like I'm doing it for other people. Like my brother couldn't finish out, so I wanted to kind of do it for him. If I'm opening the doors for other girls because it's a male-dominated sport, but anybody can do it for real. If they want to play, you know, it's equal opportunity, and, and, they're, and they're doing a good job. So hopefully, you know, we get some more girls out here. For your News Now Sports, I'm John Rawlings. Thanks, John.